What's up guys, welcome back to The Pot Stove Life. I'm Ryan. I'm AJ. We have finally found some Kirkland Signature single barrel. It actually made it to South Carolina. They kept telling us, it's not coming to South Carolina. So we were reaching out, trying to find people in yeah. Georgia, Florida. <laughs> we were calling Seriously, all, we all over the like, place. We called like five Costco's there. And we were like, first off, do you guys have a liquor department? And they're like, <laughs> yeah. We're like, do you guys have Costco? And they're like, no, we don't have it. So yeah, we, it was it was a tough look. I was reaching out to my buddy in uh, in Kentucky, Eric. And he was like, yeah, if, if my Costco has it, I'll, I'll send it down to you guys. But uh, huh. by some miracle. Yeah, I was just, I, like, I literally gave up. Cause I just thought, okay, maybe the guys don't know what they're talking about. Yeah. So I stopped in a few more times and they kept telling me, no, we're not getting it. No, we're not getting it. Just by sheer chance, a buddy was in there today looking at stuff, called me about something else he was buying, just checking a price. And then he happened to say, hey, this Kirkman Signature single bear, is that what we tried a couple months ago? I was like, well, what? They have it there? And yeah, the rest is history. Yep. We, got, we got us a bottle. So pretty excited to try this too, because we liked everything else that they had. Yeah. So this is coming out of Barton 1792. Are you um, having a stroke? Oh, we're supposed to dance. <laughs> I can't. I can't twerk. <laughs> I don't have that Miley Cyrus gene. It's uh, coming out of Barton, seventeen ninety-two. Just the same as the first two, which was the small batch and the bottled and bond. Yeah. Which the small batch we thought was pretty good. The first time I tried, it wasn't that keen on it second time thought it was pretty good yeah. bottom and bomb we absolutely love fantastic great i mean 29.99 for a liter and this is non chill filtered it is a uh, single barrel reserve and it's coming at 120 proof if this is on the level of bottled and bond kirkland's got something going on they're doing it right now and i was talking to the guy at costco today now of course they kind of let us wrong the last time but they said they didn't know they didn't expect to get it in they weren't they were told they're not supposed weren't supposed to get it in mm -hmm. and they got in out of four or five cases I got there at 11 o'clock this morning. Now, here, our liquor stores don't open until 9 o'clock. In two hours, they had already sold 50 bottles. And by the time I got, uh, I went back over there a second time with somebody, and there was about 20 to 30 bottles left, and that was it. Uh, I mean, it was going fast. Pour me some of that good old juice. That glug glug from the first pour is always, it always sounds good. I love the labeling that they're doing on this series, so I'm excited. I am too. Yeah. All right. All right, let's... Uh, well, that's right. The me legs up. on. Uh, that's not bad. It's got a nice color to it. It does. That's pretty. Mmm. God, that smells good. It's got a great smell to it. Does I mean? It, yeah. It's that brown sugar, a little bit of baking spice. It's like the sweetness is way up front. Yes, like it's that very sweet. Hit you until no, I mean, it doesn't smell like 120 yeah, proof. Yeah. It, it's not. It's not smelling like. It's like a 90 proof. Honestly. Yeah. Yeah. I it mean, it doesn't burn at all. A little bit of that corn in there. Just that corn sweetness. I'll mm. tell you what, though. It might not smell like 120 proof, but it'll clear that old nose hole up. Oh yeah, nice vanilla note there. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. See, as I'm getting more into it, <laughs> it, this side of the nose has stopped up a little bit. Well, it was. It's not anymore. <laughs> I was gonna tell you, it, like it doesn't smell like a 90 proof, but that burn is still there. Yeah. It might burn a little bit. Yeah. I tell you, what, I'm getting this vanilla. More I'm getting into, it, I'm getting this vanilla custard note, like a uh, creme brulee. <clears throat> what was it? Uh, over, over the, the hips. And through the, what'd you say? Over, over the, the hips. hips. Well, we're over the hips. I mean, if you're holding a glass, it's pretty much going to be over the hips. You might as well say over the feet. Because you're technically over Why not? the feet. Why not? It, Cheers. Cheers. Everything on food lips. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, All right. Wow. Ooh. Whoop. There's the burn. That was a kind of a late burn, but it's not really a, it's not it's a not really massive late. burn. No. It's enveloping the mouth in the throat hole. It tastes it's like sweet. Mm-hmm. It's definitely, I mean, it's sweet right up front, all brown sugar. You start to get a little bit of the oak mid palate. That's all sweet. And now, like right now, the oak's uh, working its way around to the front of my tongue, just on the tip yep. of my tongue, getting that oak, a uh, little bit of a oakiness there. Some got like above the teeth and the gum and it's still like kind of burning up there. Is it? Yeah, it's weird. Not yeah. in a bad way, but like it, you can tell like this, the, it might not feel to you that it's 120 proof, but the mouth knows it's 120 proof. Yeah. Because there's still some burn in there. Yeah, it's like right now, so the first sip, I wasn't getting like anything. It was just like sweetness. It was like, oh, it's good. It honestly, the first sip I thought was 
a little thin for what I was expecting. Really? Yeah. But now the second sip, now I'm starting to get that nice Kentucky hug, but it's not that punchy in the mouth burn, like you say. I mean, it's just it's no. just kind of slowly working yeah. down into my uh, esophagus and it's, you know, down my throat, working around, like I said, like I'm starting to feel it around, you know, around the gums and yeah. all around in my mouth. It's just kind of slow work. I mean, like, it's still finishing right now. Yeah. That's, yeah, a, that's a nice long finish. Yeah, the, it's the the flavor of it is just still there. Yeah. Swallow, swallow, I, it's still there. It's not yeah. going away. No, I mean, I still, <laughs> it's, it's still going. Does it go away with water? There's still some on there. It's good. You got that brown sugar, a little bit of caramel. You get that oakiness. It's a little drying. Yeah. By the time, especially on my third sip, a little bit drying, but not in a bad way. Yeah. It, it attacks you with sweetness. Yeah. I get a ton of sweetness. Yeah. Like almost overpowered. And then the alcohol hits. Like I said, in the first sip, it was all sweets, all sugar, then the burn, and then everything else just stayed. Um, not bad. It's pretty no, good. It's pretty good. Yeah. I think for, for $29, if you find it, grab a bottle. Hey. What we've been told, this is going to be kind of an exclusive product too. Yeah, I mean that was things. Yeah, so talking to the guy today, I asked him, I mean, are they bringing this back? Because I've read a few articles of saying that all three are supposed to be available by Christmas. He said they're not getting any information out of corporate if and when it's coming back. He kind of just threw something out, and it kind of makes me wonder whether it's just a thought that entered his head or not yeah. about whether maybe they're going to bring back a three pack for Christmas. That'd be kind of cool. That'd be kind of cool. I mean, you get a three pack for probably about 75 bucks. That would be one hell of a deal. Yeah. I think it's yeah, $29 for a liter. It's definitely worth it. At the moment, it could just be my, this poor night, cause this is the first I've had tonight. I'm not as excited about this one as I was the Bottled and Bond, cause the Bottled and Bond I think was great. And I want to try this again once it's got a little bit of air to it. Yeah, no, uh, I, because, I agree. Cause th that made a huge difference in the small batch for me. Didn't make much of a difference in this one. This no. one was just great for me. That was just yeah. great. I, I thought this was gonna burn at 120, yeah. but it's not. It's, as I say, this is, to me, it's better than uh, out of the, you know, fresh crack, it's yeah. better than the small batch was. Came back to the small batch after I got a little bit of air to it. I liked it. I'm excited to try this one again with, with a little bit of air to it. Thank you guys so much. Uh, if you like what we're doing, please hit that like button. Uh, hit the notification bell too if you like the videos that are coming out to make sure you don't miss any uh, as they are released. Hit the and, subscribe button. Yeah, and uh, yeah, hit that subscribe button if we like what we're doing. Until next time, be safe, enjoy, and cheers. Mm -hmm.